Today I get to marry my best friend in front of the people we both love most in life. Today marks not just a vow to you, but a vow to your parents, my parents, and all of our family and friends, but mostly it marks a vow to God. I promise that I will love you today, I'll love you tomorrow, and I'll love you until my last breath. Today I get to stand in front of you and vow my entire life to you as your husband. 1 Corinthians 13, 4 through 8. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes and always preserves. Love never fails. Lexi, I've got to strive for that kind of love. That's not a love you hear about in a song or see on a show. That's the greatest love there is. That's the greatest love that there ever will be. I vow to be that love for you because you deserve no less than that. I vow to be faithful. I vow to be there when you're sick and to cherish when you're healthy. Like, see, God has a plan for us, and if we trust that plan, I know we'll change the world. I can't do it without you. I promise to protect you, and I promise to protect our future family. I vow to love you with my whole heart and not a job less. I vow to not know where we're heading, but to enjoy every second of the journey right by your side. Unless as your husband, I want you to know that I take that as the highest honor there is. I promise to always love you, and I vow to never stop. first time, Mr. and Mrs. Burke. Woo! Thank you.